U.S. President Joe Biden is hoping the support of a famous American political family will help boost his re-election bid this November. Several members of the Kennedys endorsed Biden at a campaign event this afternoon in Philadelphia. The daughter of Robert F. Kennedy, Carrie Kennedy, spoke to the crowd about the U.S. president. We want to make crystal clear our feeling that the best way forward for America is to re-elect Joe Biden and Kamala Harris to four more years. <laughs> President Biden has been a champion for all the rights and freedoms that my father and uncle stood for. That's why nearly every single grandchild of Joe and Rose Kennedy supports Joe Biden. Nick Harper is a journalist in Washington. He has more on what an endorsement from members of the Kennedy family means for Joe Biden. Well, Andrew, for Biden himself, it was clearly a very emotional moment. He became emotional on stage after those comments from Kerry Kennedy. He said that it was an incredible honor to have the support of the Kennedy family. Of course, bear in mind that the uh, Kennedy name is a political institution here in the United States, a political dynasty spanning back decades. And it's a name that carries a great deal of support and potentially a great deal of donor money as well. In many ways, John F. Kennedy is one of the most beloved Democratic presidents of all time. We heard from Kerry Kennedy boosting uh, President Biden. She spoke about how he was her hero. Uh, she said that they were pledging their unwavering support for Joe Biden. And said, they said that he was a leader that runs towards flames. And she contrasted him with President Biden's uh, rival in November's election, the former president, Donald Trump, speaking about Trump's outrageous lies and behavior. So plenty of Kennedys on stage there to give that public show of support, that endorsement, but they'll also be making phone calls and knocking on doors for the Biden campaign. Of course, these type of endorsements are critical for any politician. Biden hoping to get uh, further endorsements, as we've seen this week, him courting the unions, speaking to steel workers, trying to win support from that sector as well. But undoubtedly a boost for the president today in his re-election bid, having all of those Kennedys on stage and speaking so forcefully for his re-election. And Nick, there is a Kennedy running against Biden for president as an independent candidate, Robert F. Kennedy Jr. Several of his siblings were on stage with Joe Biden at that rally. So can you tell us more about him and why so many in his own family are not endorsing him? Yeah, very interesting, this, the optics of it. Kerry Kennedy, who was speaking, endorsing Biden, is the sister of Robert F. Kennedy Jr. Many of them have spoken out against him in recent months. They say he's a divisive figure, but also a dangerous figure. In the past, he has pushed a number of conspiracy theories. He's pushed misinformation about health issues online. He's even helped to amplify claims that the CIA were behind the assassination of John F. Kennedy. On top of that, he's also suggested that the Republicans stole the 2004 presidential election from the Democrats. As for the Biden campaign themselves, they're certainly fearful of John F. Kennedy, uh, Robert F. Kennedy Jr., I should say. Uh, they fear that he will pull votes away from President Biden in November's election. So this is why we're seeing this type of public endorsement, really trying to do all they can to stamp out that challenge from the independent candidate. Journalist Nick Harper in Washington.